Well, good morning, friends. Today is a Friday, and I thought I'd bring you along to um, do our day because I'm going to be doing some cooking and see Blaze's new warehouse space, which is 10 times the size of the space that he's currently in. He's in our basement right now. He sells on Amazon. If you didn't see my last vlog, um, we went out and saw the exterior of the warehouse today. Um, Neve and I will probably walk out and see the inside because they're going to be doing some cleaning in there. So, um, yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. And so I thought I'd bring you along. There might be a little motivation with just what the day has to bring with cooking and maybe some cleaning. I did a lot of cleaning yesterday as I knew today. Wouldn't be super... Um, productive with cleaning and sometimes you just can't pick up a camera and film you just need to get stuff done so yeah i'm gonna bring you along today i hope you enjoy coming along and um just enjoy watching so i'm gonna be making some cookies with a recipe my mom has given me and i put my apron on and little miss here had to have her apron on too <laughs> Um, we got it from some friends who are missionaries in Africa, actually. Some of our best friends are there. So it's handmade, and she just likes wearing it, I think. So, yeah, I'm going to make some cookies here, and I'll um, put the recipe in the description box for you. I'm gonna start a sprinkler because I actually am doing some succession planting. In my last vlog I had um, beets right there. Sorry, the sun is really, there that's better, um, where I have the orange flag. But now I planted another round of beets because they're 60 days and our first frost isn't supposed to be till the end of September so you go back from them that date. And yeah, I should get some beets. And I planted some beans which are coming up really well. And yesterday, the wind must have tunneled. My giant sunflower just just snapped. Really sad, but I need to start. Um, yeah, start the sprinkler here. I've picked a basket full of sweet corn. It's been amazing. My squash bugs are still present. Um, I found a natural spray, but it still doesn't seem to be working as well. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna maybe have to next year move my pumpkins and squash all together to a different location but it's still been a really good year of gardening I'd have to say so with the sweet corn I'm going to use that for tomorrow as we have people coming to help Blaze move into his new space um, and then I'll make some enchiladas which I'm going to make today and then we also had a young mom have a baby last week well she's now a young mom and so I'm going to make an extra enchilada for them not spicy because I know how breastfeeding can be if you have spicy sometimes. Um, and then so the corn will be for lunch tomorrow. And then I'll probably share some more with some other friends. I just love having a prevalence, I think that's the right word, for of produce to be able to share for other people. And it's just a blessing to give to those people. And then I should have enough with five rows of corn to freeze some as well. Um, I still had some beets left and so I need to use those up. I pickled some beets yesterday. I shared on my Instagram stories and a picture on Instagram. My first time pickling and I used honey um, instead of the refined sugar. I just, I like having that natural option. Uh, just healthier for your body and for our little girl. I just like to eat a little bit healthier. I do have refined sugar, don't get me wrong there, but just when I can choose, I will do that. So anyways, um, the cookies I just pulled out of the oven and so I need to put another 
batch on. Nevaeh is napping, so I'm gonna start browning some hamburger. I'm gonna use actually some deer burger mixed in because it won't be so prevalent with that taste of the deer since it's um, in a sauce and in an enchilada. So I'm gonna start browning that hamburger. Well, I got the enchiladas made. I don't know if I actually have enough, so I might have to brown some more hamburger. But I have four in here. I just used an enchilada, store-bought enchilada sauce, um, the El Paso brand. It was on sale at our grocery store. And I used the mild, so it's not too spicy. And then here's the big one. I gotta put some cheese on top. Still, stick this one in the fridge and the other one, and they should be good to bake for tomorrow. Here's the new workspace. Yeah, we can just cruise around in our stroller, huh? No need to get down. <laughs> yeah, she's like, give me down. This is nice, so your area ends at the big pole. Uh, yeah, it goes all the way to this first office right here. Okay, and that'll be yours, huh? Yep. What are you gonna do with the other office? That one's not ours. The one that's open is not yours? This one right here is not. Oh no, yeah, but isn't this? Oh, that's one big one. One big one. It's, so it's probably it's a- the size of our basement. Oh, that space is the size of our- That's oh. the size of our basement almost. Yeah, that was, I see that. That's what we were working out of. Oh my goodness. Except for our basement had more stuff in it. Yeah. Wow, this is nice. And then the bath, one bathroom over there. Wow. Wow. Well, I haven't talked to you in a little bit. So we went out to my husband's workspace after lunch. Lunch was leftover roasted um, vegetables, some from our garden, and then deer sausage. Hi, <laughs> sweetie. Um, so that was really good. Then we went out to my husband's new facility and just got to see that space. And then we went for a little walk. Nevaeh then had a short nap. And so did I, honestly. I had about 15, 20 minute nap. I just needed to, I was really tired today. So did that. Um, then I started sanding down a chair I got in my last thrift haul. It's a wicker seated chair. So you can check that out in that thrift haul. You silly, you silly. Um, yeah, so now we're just gonna play for a little bit. Supper on Fridays <laughs> is always pizza. Sometimes I do my sourdough pizza dough, but tonight is an Aldi Supreme pizza, so very simple. Um, not a huge plan for the rest of the day. It's 3.30 already, so the day goes quickly when there's a lot going on. Hold on, hold on. Good job. Is that so fun? Yeah, is that so fun? 
Make sure you hold on. <laughs> Good job. Well, everyone, I'm gonna call it a night. We had our supper, our pizza from Aldi. We love getting those Supreme pizzas. They're like six bucks and so good. Um, and then I roasted some beets and squash just to have some vegetables on the side and use some of that wonderful garden produce. Um, I also decided to whip up some brownies. It was just a box mix, but I added coconut oil instead of vegetable oil, substituted that and some drops of orange vitality essential oil from young living mm, that's really good just to add a little extra boost of flavor so those will be for tomorrow as well but well actually blaze and i tried some tonight so they're really good but we um, packed up a few more of his items as well got things cleaned up here in the house and just um yeah got a few things done which needs to happen i love going to bed with a clean kitchen wiping things down um, it's just so nice to wake up to a clean home and makes me feel much better to go about my morning. So it's about 9 p.m. We're going to clean up because working hard today and we're both exhausted. So hope you enjoyed coming along with me today and we'll talk with you in the next one. Bye. Bye.